the commitment to revolution, to the complete overthrow of savage oppression and the spectrum of ignorant or disingenuous evil reaction is also a commitment to work and study. It is a commitment to organization and mass expression. Where are our revolutionary journals, the newspapers, the magazines? Where are our revolutionary movie houses and galleries and theaters? Instead, we hear snoring or the fashionable cynicism of the loyal opposition. It is the self-determination and self-respect and self-defense of life and its revolutionary movement that the poets must concern themselves with as intimately as their own personal lives. It is form as well as content, essence, science, and vision. Art must be our magic weapon to create and recreate the world and ourselves as part of it.